Hey guys, this is Marie, AKA Ella James, Valentine special, and welcome back to my channel. On today's episode, I'm gonna show you all how to make Valentine's on a budget. For all you lovers out there, singles, crushes, whatever, I'm gonna show you how to make things from the heart without breaking a bank. With that said, Let's get started. Hey guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to be creative on a budget. Um, I went out and bought a lot of Valentine's items, um, some things I'm gonna prepare from the heart without breaking the bank. So everything here on this table cost me under $10. Um, not saying that you have to go and buy stuff under $10, just, you know, if you wanna save some money and not do too much, because Valentine's to me is so overrated but I'm just gonna make it easy for some people that just don't wanna go out and spend so much and probably just do things, um, you know, to make it easier for themselves on these special days. Well, I went out and bought some marshmallows, marshmallow hearts, so they are really cute. So I decided to add this on my cake when I'm done, when it's finished baking, I'm gonna just sprinkle these over my cake. Um, also, I went out to buy the cake mix this cost me a dollar for this box. These cake mix boxes is not really that expensive. I bought the frosting and it came with the sprinkles and they are heart shaped, which is so cool. I also went out and bought some Lifesaver gummies. I'm going to add these on top of my cake as well, just to give it a little cuteness. And also I'm gonna fill up my little containers. These are hearts I bought from Walgreens, very nice little a dollar pack. You know, you get a multiple, I think I had about eight of these each and they both come with the top. So therefore you can add stuff in these and snap it. Give it to your, your little sweetheart or your kids. And just tell them how much you care. So you're sweet for the day and you got stuff in there, that's awesome. All right, so I'm gonna start first with the cake. So that can go ahead and bake. And after that point, I'll just um, start creating this stuff like on paper. Um, I'm very creative, so I like to draw and, and cut stuff. and So that's what I'm going to do today, just to be a little creative. All right, guys, so let's start with the cake. It's not that, not that hard, you know. I normally make um, homemade stuff. I'm not a box person, so today I'm just doing this because it's Valentine's Day and I'm not really trying to put my heart into like making something homemade at this point. Um, homemade would have probably cost me more versus, you know, bad it, you know, just for this day. So we just add the whole package. And after that point, you add a, a cup of water and then one egg and some vegetable oil. So I have my egg, which is, you only need one egg. You just crack that in there. Um, to me, I just put a little bit of this in there. I probably would use coconut oil or some olive oil, but today I'm just gonna follow the directions on the box so my cake, from the box could come out exactly as directed, so. So let's just put a little bit of that. And now I'm going to add one cup of water. Just go ahead and stir that. You know, take your time from the first time. So. If there's not enough water, go ahead and add some more water to this. It should blend within two minutes, two or three minutes. All right, it smoothed out pretty quick. It looks very moist. Show you guys that looks really good the texture of the cake is going to be nice so i'm going to go ahead and 
use my baking pan here that I brought over and spray it just so it don't stick to the pan. You can add butter, coconut oil, olive oil, whatever you want to add to the bottom as long as it doesn't stick. You just want to make sure it doesn't stick. I want to add just a little bit more water. Loosen it up a little bit. I feel like it's like really tight. But that's just me. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and add this into the cake pan. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add Set the oven to 350 and just set the baking pan into the oven for about, let's see, on the box it says about 30, 35 minutes for baking. So, all right, so we're going to set that down and let that go ahead and bake and then we're going to get to the next project. All right, all right. While that's baking, I am going to go ahead and fill up my little heart containers and attach the lids to each one. So put a couple of gummy bears in each one or lifesavers. They're so cute. They have the they are hearts, little hearts. <laughs> lifesavers, too cute. And you can create these, like I said, these containers are only a dollar. Give them to your kids, your family, friends, or coworkers. They will love it. All right, so I filled each one, so I have eight total. All right, so I'm now going to just add the lids to it. That's the lid for that. Too cute. I like that. Give it to a friend. You know what? I might just um, do mix the color up a little bit. It don't have to always be the color to color. It could be red to pink. Light pink to red. All right, guys, so that is done. Too cute. I love these. So I'm ready for that. So I'm going to set that aside. All right, guys, on my next project, I'm going to use art paper, just a pen, and cut it out with my little scissors here. So, you know, just being a little creative, you know, so I'm just going to draw this heart. I love being creative. And making things. And what I like to do, I like to take each one and kind of like cut it. You don't want to cut your fingers or anything, so be careful when you're doing this project. There we go. I got a heart. Cute. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make four of these, but watch out the project turn out at the end. And for each heart, you go ahead and write on them. Just put, you know, you write any words like forever, be mine, you're sweet, anything. You can write whatever you want on these. So I'm just going to write on each one. And I 
wrote, wrote be mine on this one. So now I'm going to create them out of something and make it really cute. Now you can use some tape and just get ready to create whatever you want to do. Now is just attach it, be creative. Just attach it to one end of another heart. Then you just bring it around, attach it like so. Just press on it and make sure the tape is binding. And there's one, but um, we're gonna bring these two ends together. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna take some tape and just tape it onto the back like that. And make sure it's pressed in really good. So now you have a heart shaped cup. What you can do is fill it up with whatever you want. So with the jelly gummy bears in here, you can take it and add it to here. You can fill it up and give it to a friend. Just that simple. Now, to tell you the truth about this, this is music that we all, this next composition, it's the music that we all should do. made my masterpiece I made a bowl with and then you can dump the little hearts with the lifesaver gummies in here you know? all right my cake is all ready and it's cool I let it cool for about 20 20 seconds 20 or 30 seconds or five minutes you know you can give it get a chance to cool so it's been cooling for a while because I was creating my other projects all right now we can go ahead and add the frosting I usually use a spoon just to, you know, stir it up a little bit, but it should be good. Nice and pink. So we can go ahead and add that to the cake. And you can go ahead and kind of just smooth it on. Put enough frosting on there. You can use a knife. You can use a spoon. All right, so now I'm just going to go ahead and add the sprinkles. All right, so we're just gonna sprinkle some of these on here. I'm actually go ahead and sprinkle a lot of it on here. And it should look like that. Very nice. After you add the sprinkles, go ahead and add the Lifesaver gummies and the marshmallow hearts and voila here's the creation all set cake i had to taste it so it's very good all right so there you have it Woo that was awesome and you guys rock well guys this wraps up my valentine special for today give this video a big thumbs up if you found this information helpful don't forget to click subscribe to my channel for more videos and weekly updates. And leave a comment below just to say hi or suggest a video. Thank you all for watching Ella James taking Tuesdays to the max. I'll see you all next week. Bye.